In a world where people care more about Kim Kardashian than scientific discoveries, it makes sense that most people take landing a rover on Mars for granted. And although the discoveries on Mars may seem slight, remember that they were all done on another planet by humans. Before we jump into the discoveries, I want to fill you in on exactly how the rover landed on the red planet. Curiosity was compacted inside a saucer-like disk that shielded the spacecraft from the atmosphere during entry to the planet. After deploying a parachute, the Curiosity Sky Crane assembly was released once the speed was reduced less than about 90 meters per second. At this point, the assembly's four deceleration rockets were triggered, each in the corners, to slow the craft down in which the rover was lowered down to the surface. This, in essence, is a rocket sky crane, in fact that's what they called it, autonomously landing on another planet. Once the rover touched down, the sky crane released the cord and jetted off into the hillside to prevent any damage to the rover itself by crashing near it. This is one of the single most greatest engineering feats man has ever accomplished, let alone on another planet. Number five, major diversity of environments near the landing area. Apparently scientists didn't really expect the level of diversity in soil and rock types near the landing zone. There were signs of gravel and stream bed deposits as well as unusual types of volcanic rock. Sand dunes, mineral veins, and mudstones were also all discovered near the landing area, which was kind of near a crater. Number four, lack of methane. Almost all life on Earth produces methane in some capacity. Although Curiosity checked out the atmosphere, no methane was found. This helped NASA almost instantly rule out the possibility of life, though they're still looking. Number three, humans versus radiation. NASA has a specific rating for radiation levels they allow the astronauts to experience. Curiosity discovered the radiation on Mars was far greater than the astronauts' limit, leading to better designed and safer spacesuits and capsules for when humans go explore the red planet. Number two, an ancient ocean. So ocean might be a little overkill, but Curiosity did find smooth and rounded rocks on the planet's surface as well as broken sidewalls where layers of bedrock can be seen cemented sediments. This indicates there was likely knee-deep flowing water on the planet. Number one, a home for life. The key ingredients for life such as hydrogen, oxygen, and sulfur were all found on the surface. With the indication of water on the planet supported by low salt content clay materials resulting in likely fresh water, Mars houses all of the necessary ingredients for life to form on the red planet. In fact, they did find organic material, which organic material is technically not life, but it is kind of like the building blocks. So if you enjoyed this video, give it a like and share with your friends on Facebook and Twitter, as well as letting us know in the comments down below future video ideas, as well as a planet that you would want to visit if you can visit any planet. Anyways, guys, it's been Mike Rodolfi for It's All Viral. Thanks for watching.